Hey there, welcome back to the balance work. Ever feel like you're constantly competing with a co-worker, even when you're not trying to? You're just doing your thing, and they're trying to keep up, outdo, or maybe even, outshine you. Let's talk about why that might be happening and what you can do about it. Okay, so here's the deal. Competition in the workplace. Totally normal. Some people see your success as a green light to step up their game, while others might feel threatened. Let's go through the most common reasons why they might be acting this way. 1. They want what you have maybe you got promoted, or you just seem to be thriving. They want that same progress, and they think competing with you is how they'll get it. Honestly, this can be a healthy push. Everyone wants to get ahead, right? 2. It's an ego thing ever had someone compete with you over every little thing. They're feeding their ego, trying to double you in at work. It's annoying, and it's not even productive, but for them, it's a way to feel good about themselves. 3. They feel threatened sometimes, a co-worker might worry that you'll replace them. If your work stands out, they could see you as a rival, even if that's not your intention. 4. They dislike you not everyone's going to be your biggest fan. They might just dislike you and show it by constantly competing. When they do better, they feel like they've won something. 5. They admire you on a positive note, your co-worker might actually admire you. They're not trying to be annoying, they're just following your lead because they respect what you bring to the table. 6. They want to prove themselves some people feel the need to show they're just as good, or better. They might act like they can replace you to prove their worth. 7. They want to impress the boss Impressing the boss can be a big motivator. They might be trying to compete to stay on the boss's radar, hoping it'll lead to that next promotion. 8. They're under pressure sometimes, a co-worker feels like they need to get that next role or recognition, and competing with you feels like their only way forward. Alright, so you've figured out why they're acting this way. Now let's talk about how to handle it without getting pulled into their game. 1. Let them do their thing if their competition doesn't affect your work, ignore it. Smile, stay calm, and let them think they're winning. You're focusing on what actually matters. 2. Talk it out if things start crossing a line, like if they're badmouthing you, then a quick chat can help. Let them know you're both on the same team here. 3. Loop in the boss if needed when competition turns toxic and starts affecting your peace of mind or your work, it's okay to let your boss know what's up. They can help set boundaries if things get out of hand. 4. Stay focused on your own goals don't get distracted by other people's moves. Stay focused on your own goals, your projects, and what you need to succeed. 5. Try to understand their side if you take a moment to understand why they're competing, you might realize it's not as personal as it feels. That perspective can go a long way in helping you stay calm. Remember, a little workplace competition isn't always a bad thing, but you don't have to be part of the game if you don't want to. Just stay focused, stay positive, and keep being the awesome employee you are. Thanks for watching, and if you've got a story about dealing with workplace competition, drop it in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.